How teen went from Drake-loving schoolgirl to jihadi bride intent on terror on UK streets. With her gushing Facebook posts on Drake and the Twilight movies, Rise Lane Buller appeared to be like any other UK schoolgirl. She bragged about holidays abroad, uploaded photos of herself in the park and moaned about getting her science homework done. But just a few years later she found herself lying down on the ground having been shot by armed police who stormed a northwest London home fearing she was about to unleash carnage. While other girls her age would go on to seek a life of friendship and fun, Rise Lane slipped into a downward spiral of extremism that has ended with her, her mum Mina Deitch and sister Safa facing years behind bars for being part of a chilling Mad Hatter terror team. Yesterday at the Old Bailey Safa was found guilty of preparing for acts of terror. Rise Lane and her mum had both earlier pleaded guilty. The mugshot sent out by police marked a stark fall from grace for the older sister who aged 14 thought of little more than her favorite rap star. In one haunting Facebook post in 2010, Rise Lane wrote, OMG. La vie, Drake. And uploaded an entire album of images of the superstar. In another she talked about Hollywood heartthrob Taylor Lautner going topless in his hit movie Twilight, New Moon. The teen posted, New Moon was absolutely amazing. Taylor topless full screen He was so sexy. And in a photo of the family on holiday, she wrote, My mum in DA middle, sisters on DA side and me at DA top in Tunisia. But within a matter of years she would be using social media for something altogether more sinister plotting bloodshed. During Sister Safa and Hashek's 27 semicolon s trial the dysfunctional nature of her family was revealed with the court hearing how mum Mina forced extreme views on the pair. Diabetic Safa, who maintained a good relationship with her father, accused Deitch of being violent, domineering and vindictive. The court heard how Deitch would throw mugs at the pair and spit at them. The two sisters grew up in a tense facing flat in Vauxhall, South London just across the road from the headquarters of MI6. Originally a non-religious household, as the girls grew up Deitch adopted a conservative version of Islam, using online instructions to guide her. And within a matter of years she began lecturing her daughters about the need to cover themselves and wear traditional Islamic dress. When Rise Lane was 16, Mina discovered her daughter was talking to a man online and in a fury assaulted her, prompting Rise Lane to run away. A friend of the teenager also told the Times that everything changed for Rise Lane around this time after she slept with a boy from school and was left devastated when he brushed her off. The female friend, who did not want to be named, said, The trouble all stemmed from that relationship. She felt really let down. And she wasn't in hash x27 semicolon t a virgin anymore, which is a big deal in Islam. Ditch also reacted strongly when she discovered Safa spoke to boys from her school on the phone and duly confiscated it. Twice divorced Deitch pressured the girls to abandon their western lifestyle and follow her extremist beliefs. She married Rise Lane off to a local mom old enough to be her father and banned Safa from listening to music and watching television and forced to view extremist YouTube videos. The girls in hash x27, Dada Dil Buller, 52 who left teaching assistant Deitch in 2006, is adamant his ex-partner is where the blame lies. The taxi driver said, whatever they have done so far, they and hash x27 semicolon v done to please their mother. They will say anything to make their mother happy. After the November 2015 Paris attacks, Sofa began investigating what is was about online and began speaking to hundreds of activists online. She told her trial. It was special, it was exciting. I was not allowed to go out with my friends from school, so to have these friends was exciting. One of the activists she met was Noid Hussein, 32, from Coventry who went to Syria in June 2015. The pair enjoyed an online romance, sometimes talking for up to 12 hours a day. The schoolgirl initially planned to join him in war-torn Raqqa where they would carry out a suicide attack and die holding hands. But her plans were foiled when Hussein was killed in an airstrike and she was arrested after a family holiday to Morocco. She then encouraged her sister Rise Lane Buller, 22, and mother, Mina Deitch, 44, 
to carry out a knife attack in Westminster in order to carry the torch forward. They called their plan the atrocity the Mad Hatter's Tea Party during conversations monitored by MI5. The day before Rise Lane was arrested she and her mum bought a knife with a six-inch blade from Sainsbury's. Safat was found guilty on Monday, after her mum and sister had previously admitted the charge. She had argued that it was all make-believe and had told the jury, it and hash x27 semicolon s online, nothing online is real. Mr. Buller said after the guilty verdict, my daughters were failed by their mother. Email us at tips you can whatsapp us on 0781079150 We pay for videos too. Click here to upload yours.